Hey, 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 welcome back to Mirror Expressions. Take a moment. I'm going to pause. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Hit that like button. You know, the one that looks like this. Go ahead and take a minute to hit it. And while you're at it, go ahead and hit that subscribe. I think it's written down there in like some red letters. Hit that button as well. And as always, drop a mirror emoji in the chat. Let me know how you all are doing. Let me know if you looked in the mirror today, because I'm sure you have. But let me know if you feel A1 with what you see looking back. And if not, take whatever avenues you must to get back to a healthier you. All right, y'all. I'm shaking up this jar. Y'all, my little jar getting a lot of action. My little flower getting a little... Might have to make us a new jar here soon. Or, re or repurpose this one. Maybe put a different little flower up there. Or a different little something or another. All right. Alright, I pulled out about two or three. Oof. I did pull out two or three. <laughs> and I, I got to look, yeah. Matter of fact, I think I will uh oh. I dropped it. Maybe I didn't need to do that. I was gonna say I wanna do those two. They actually kind of fell in line with each other. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Anyways, I don't I don't know where it fell it fell to. I think it fell. It must have fallen slid up under the desk. But anyways, it said that you only fail if you don't try. I like that. Um you only fail if you don't try. And then the other one I have says Forget the mistake and remember the lesson. And the reason I said those kind of went hand in hand. So let's talk about you only fail if you don't try. Okay, my little sisters, they're here again. They're just taking over. They're taking over. And they want to be seen. So you only fail if you don't try. It's because if you don't give your hand to something, if you allow fear to hold you back, that's an automatic fail, right? Because you're not giving yourself the opportunity to succeed. You're not giving yourself an opportunity to win, right? Let's say you're running a race, or running a race, or you're about to run a <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Then, then my babies, then my babies keep knocking this camera. But anyway, let's use the example. You're you're about to run a race, right? The goal of the race, of course, is to cross the finish line first, right? You got your first place, your second place, and your third place runners. It's five runners, right? If you pull out the race before the race begins, you've already failed. You've taken away your opportunity to be a first place winner, to be a second place winner, to be a third place winner, or just the, the feel to know, hey, at least I tried. At least I went out there and gave my all. You also take away the opportunity that if you did not win, you take away the opportunity for you to learn different things that could help you in the future place where you want to place. Meaning you at the race and let's say you did decide to win, run the race. You don't win first. You don't win second. You don't win third, but you completed the race. You could have learned from that, that, hey, maybe if I get my knees up higher. Maybe if I run in a different type of shoe. Maybe if I wear my hair a different way. 
those things may help me run faster and I may place. But if you're not even going to run, you don't know this. You're not learning things along the way. Does that make sense, y'all? You're, you're taking away so much from yourself when you don't even try. The only fa failure is not trying. I think that's those were the exact words. The only failure is not trying. Because let's just be honest, everything that you give your hand to, you're not going to get it right away. It's not going to always be successful, but that's okay. If you try, that's the thing, right? You may be successful. You may be on the first time. But if you allow fear to hold you back, you will never know. You will stay in the same place you are. You will remain stagnant and you're not allowing any room for growth. That's called being complacent. That's called settling. And who wants to do that, right? We should always strive for better. We should always strive to be better. We should want to be the best versions of ourselves. And we can't do that if we remain stagnant. And then as far as this, it says forget the mistake and remember the lesson. That kind of goes along with having opportunities to learn things along the way. You can learn from your failures. You can learn from your mistakes. Life is full of mistakes. Some knowingly, right? Sometimes we know we do things and we know the outcome just is not favorable. And some unknowingly, sometimes mistakes just happen. But it's not about holding on to the mistake. It's what you could have learned. From that mistake. Failure. Is a chance to learn. The only real failure. Is if you don't try. Continue to make. Life, life's journey. A learning process. Continue. To take. Your. Your. Mistakes right and turn them into lessons continue to better yourself continue to face your fears continue to be courageous right continue to strive to be the best version of yourself do it on a daily that's why we do these affirmations. I think I've said this or shared this with y'all before in one of my other affirmation videos. I keep an affirmation on my mirror. I let it serve me daily as a reminder. And sometimes that's all it takes. Sometimes you need that same word, right? And sometimes it's good to have different, which is why I provide y'all with a different word every day. But sometimes you need that same word when you hear something, it, it drills into you. You know what I'm saying? And for me, one of my affirmations that I keep on, a, on, on my mirror is the scripture. I can do all things through Christ, which strengthens me. And that encompasses so much. I can do all. My all I have in capital letters. Because that means there is nothing I'm not shortchanging myself. The only, only person that can hold me back is me. I saw that recently on somebody's post on Facebook, and that's the truth. There's nobody that can hold me back but myself. So why would I do that? I keep that as that reminder. I can do all, A-L-L, -L, all things through Christ, which strengthens me, right? All right, y'all, I'm seeing this video. It's hitting that nine-minute mark. I didn't mean to get on here and be preachy. But um, just remember, there's no failure other than not trying, right? And that no, no, uh, forget the mistake, but take your lessons, okay? And that includes your failures. Don't, don't let them hold you back. Don't let them get you down. Take the lesson. 
keep moving, keep growing, continue to strive to be the best version of yourself. That's all I got, y'all. Let me know what you got from these two. And until next time, I'll talk to you later. I pray for you. You pray for me. And we will continue to watch God change things. Bye, y'all.